What is up heroes, it's Midnight Zero, and welcome back to the Let's Play Silent Hill Blind. In the last episode, we, we ran into Sybil in this dark world, which is merging with our real world, it seems. And we ran into Dahlia, the, the dark, crazy lady. And it seems like our next goal is to go to the lighthouse. Yes, the lighthouse. Um, I believe Sybil said she was going to the amusement park? I think. Regardless, we've got our goal ahead of us. Is there anything else we need in here? I don't think so. It said we couldn't use this, right? Or not to worry about it for now. Just for now. Later on, I'm sure we'll be using it. Um, can we go out this way? Oh, we can. I was wondering how we were going to get to the lighthouse when it was blocked off in the other path. But my questions have been answered. Oh. Um... I just realized this is the the map, but our radio is working all fine and dandy again. We have our hammer equipped. I think I'm going to leave that for the time being. Yeah, I think so. Because, like, when it really comes down to it, I'm going to try to avoid using my... Oh, where... Oh, it was behind me. The swoopy swiper. Looked like a much more normal swoopy swiper, though. Oh, what was that that change in perspective? Obviously, the camera was showing me where to go next, but... Oh, can we, um... Oh, I accidentally hit triangle. Wanna, wanna... Oh, man, are they... They're just, like, all over me. All right, turn around, come on. Go, Harry, go! Is there something back here? There's totally something back here. Please tell me it was worth my time. It was not worth my time, guys. We're doing okay on health. After the next hit, that's when we'll heal up. All right... Keep on running. Keep on going. You can do it, Harry. I believe in you. Doesn't look like there's anything over there. Anything this way? Nope. Okay. That's what I get for exploring. Oof. Into the into the chain gate. Oh! Well, hello there. Can I interact with that, or do I need to go over here? I, I'll take it I need to go over here. Do I need to go up here? Probably. Okay. I think we're making progress, guys. I don't know exactly where we're going. But it appears we're making progress. So if I turn left there, I'll probably get to the lighthouse. Of course, just for the sake of exploring and curiosity, we'll check what's out in the end of that, that dead end there. Oh, avoid the swoopy swiper. Avoid it. Go, Harry, go. I believe in you. Okay, keep running. You're getting a good workout. I need a good workout. But I'm not a big fan of running, unfortunately. Not like Harry. Harry's a... Harry's a running veteran at this point. I just get so bored. I've tried listening to music, and, and I always get an upset stomach after like half an hour or so. It's been that way for a long time. Even when I just like am running for the sake of playing like basketball or something like that. If it's if it goes on for a while, I always end up feeling really sick for a few hours afterwards. Not a lot of fun. Even if the sport is very fun. Okay, we have found the lighthouse. Hurry, Harry, into the lighthouse. No, no. <laughs> Some zombie is chowing down on us right now. Oh, okay. I don't know what was different about my angle or something like that, but we were able to enter the door. Whew. That base. Um, okay, so we've got, like I said, one more hit before I think we're really in, you know, danger territory. Let's save while we're here. Make sure we don't accidentally walk outside. Can I walk a little bit forward? Do I need to approach it from this angle? There we go. We are in the lighthouse. Now, if it is a very true lighthouse, there's probably not a whole lot to explore here, so I'm just gonna climb on up. This camera angle. This spiral, I'm digging it. Good stuff, Silent Hill, good stuff. What are we gonna see from up here? Are we gonna see the darkness enveloping the town? Are we gonna have a boss fight up here? Whoa. Wait. Who was that again? It's too late. Who was that again? Whoa, it's all like 
blurry and everything. Also, this seal is really cool. Is there anything going on up here? Am I supposed to just, like, head back down now? Or what? Um... I guess... Does it show a check mark through it? I think it does. I don't know. Oh, he said he was too late. It looked like it was to, to I don't know, reach that apparition. But looking at the mark on the ground and how it's all like orange and lit and everything, it's probably referring to that seal. Let's see if we can use the Floros. Nope, we can't. All right, well, then I guess we'll head down. I'm trying to remember who that was. Was that like one of the nurses? It wasn't the nurse from the hospital. It didn't look like Cheryl though. So I don't think that was Cheryl. Man, trying to go down a spiral staircase with tank controls. <laughs> they, uh, they really didn't think that went through. Um, Alright, well, we'll head out of the lighthouse again. I don't know where else we're supposed to go now. The game will probably tell us. Oh my! There's a lot coming right after us. So I guess... I mean, it looks like there's a check mark through the lighthouse, so... Did that hit us? It did, okay. So we'll use a health drink. Play it on the safe side. I guess we'll, we'll fight... Oh. Or not. We can, we can run. Wow! <laughs> the enemies are swarming us yet again. Okay, so we'll, we'll run and see what we can do. Do we just enter a cutscene of some sort? Hopefully. I'd prefer that. Sybil hasn't come back. We've got to go after her and make sure she's safe. That creep's sure to show up at the amusement park pretty soon. Let me be on time. Gotcha. So that, that creep is referring to that apparition we just saw, right? That lady. Interesting. And so we've got to make our way to the amusement park now. I appreciate that they spared me having to run through everything again. So we'll save again now that we're at the boat. Ooh, too dark to look at the map here. <laughs> That's actually really funny. I didn't even realize that was something to be considered. You can't look at the map when it's too dark. So do we try to just go to the amusement park now? It was blocked off before. We could always try the wheel again. Okay. All right. Well, I guess we'll head over there again. I don't see much else to do. We're going to have to navigate this area again. Or is it just going to show us a cutscene? Aw, oh, man. Alright, well, we'll try running through. Alright, we're going in the right direction, I think. Got the doggos running after us. Again, let's just check, make sure we're going the right way. Okay, so that's all fine and dandy. We're gonna be turning left when we can. I'm very curious about the story of this game. I wonder also, are, are all the Silent Hill games connected? Like, is this a long series where, I mean, it's obviously a long series, I know there are quite a few games, but are they all directly connected or are they just like within the same universe or, you know? I guess what I'm asking is how essential is it that we play the first one before the second one. Um, can we go around this way, maybe? Um, we got our friends coming after us, unfortunately. So how are we gonna get to the amusement park? It looks like back there, there's that arrow um, that I maybe just incidentally discovered. There we go. Oh, our dog friend there to greet us. How lovely. Wait, is this, is this where we came from, or is this to the amusement park? Let's see. Aw, oh, really? Leave me alone. Um, is it that, like, area there? I don't know. Is it this thing? I don't think so. It kind of looks like it though, right? It looks like we should be able to go over there. Maybe it's just the, maybe it truly is the underground pathway. All right, we'll try it because I'm tired of running around these things. 
No! Down the... I tried to hit X, guys. I promise. I'm really... I'm really trying. The cover has been removed. Could Sybil have gotten to the amusement park from here? Oh, okay. Back underground we go. I will say, I do find the enemies more annoying than... Than, than beneficial to the game's atmosphere and such at this point, but... Is that... Oh, it's Sybil! Hopefully we don't spook her. I have the feeling... Uh-oh. She's met a, a rather unfortunate fate. Okay. This is gonna be our map. There's a sewer map. Connecting to amusement park. Take it, yes. Okay. Looks like a relatively straightforward map. Let's see what we can find. Oh, we're starting on this end. Did not realize that. Naturally, there are enemies, and our radio is not going to work. That's right, because we are underground. Aw. Uh, what? Man, those things are intense. Keep running, Harry. Oh, what? Alright. Time to, uh... Huh? What? Why did I just turn like that? What is that sound? Why, why am I hearing that? It sounds like somebody's trying to, like, whisper something to me. Alright, well, regardless, we'll head over this way now. There are presumably... Man, what are all these, like, dead bodies on the side and everything? Not a very inviting atmosphere. Anything over this way? Nice. Some ammo. Handgun bullets. Alright. What are all these, like, chains and everything on the side, too? And a health drink. We've only got a few of those left, so... We will definitely take those. And again, we are going in the correct direction now. We are. Let's let's do a little recap of our healing items. We've got three. Oh, I didn't even realize I was on such low health. We have two health drinks. We have seven first aid kits, and we have three of the ampoules. So if we're getting pretty close to the end of the game, I which I think we are, we're probably getting pretty close to the final boss. I think we'll have sufficient healing items for the final boss fight, and we'll have plenty of handgun bullets and shotgun shells um, and useless rifle shells for the... Uh, for the final boss. Oh my. What are those things? There's a lot going on here. Definitely. Alright, we'll keep going this way just to explore. See if there's anything going on. It's probably a dead end. It is. So we're going to be trapped in just a moment. But I'm too curious to not check it out. Oh, okay. Yep. Instant regret. But you know what they say, curiosity killed the, the Midnight Zero. Oh my goodness. Can we... Can we get through this? <laughs> can we... Can we not? Oh man, we'll use a first aid kit because we're really low. And we'll, we're just going to start swinging real quick. That thing... Oh, and that's something from the ceiling. Alright. I think I should at least be able to run from this point. Can you... Can you not... Oh, really? <sighs> Here's another first aid kit. I was just saying all of the all of the health items we have. Come on, let me run past. Okay. I really should have just kept running instead of trying to explore. Regardless, even despite all of that, I think we'll have enough healing items. What was that sound? Oh my. Okay. What? Can I not run across? Oh, no, I can't. Okay. Good, good, good. This music is getting really intense. How? What items do we have? We have five. Okay, so we have five and two. We should be good. How close are we getting to the end of this hallway? We are... We are there. All right, Sybil. Um, there's a horse there. Why? That's very strange. I do want to explore the area briefly. Would you listen to that music, guys? How intense is that? Are we gonna find Sybil? 
No, it looks like she she was probably that cutscene was at the amusement park, not on the way to it, probably. Okay, my favorite. I don't have the map for this place. Ah, <sighs> great. We start wandering with some enemies running around. Don't have a clue where we're going. Nice, nice. That's where we came from. Let's try going this way. Lovely. Is Sybil gonna be the final boss? Did she like get converted into some zombie or something? Where am I where am I going? Oh, oh, it's one of those things. Don't scare me like that, man. Come on. Oh, hello there. I haven't seen you in a long time. It's like the elementary school all over again. This is where I just was trying to explore and failed. We keep going this way. What, is this a merry-go-round? Of course, there's always a creepy merry-go-round, isn't there? Well, we're definitely at the amusement park. There's no doubt about that. Can we get on the merry-go-round? Doesn't look like it. At least not here. Can we keep going this way? Looks like it. Some other attraction coming up, presumably. Where am I even going? Watch, there have been, like, a map right at the beginning of the area. Like, right off, like, right after the ladder I get up, and there's actually a map right there, and I just walked completely past it. Wait, was that a map there? Oh, no, it wasn't. There's something. Stairwell? Some stairs I can walk up? Where, where are we going? Where are we going, Harry? What are we gonna find? Cutscene time! Are we on the merry-go-round? What? Is Sybil dead on the merry-go-round? She's in a wheelchair. Why? What's going on? Whoa, her eyes do not look good. Her eyes do not look good. No, no, we're gonna have to kill Sybil. Yikes. All right, it looks like Sybil is our boss, potentially. We're gonna have to fight her. I'm wondering though, I guess, I mean, we'll, we'll equip the gun. It'll just make our lives a lot easier. Turn around and get ready to shoot. Is she going to shoot us again? Or... That didn't seem to do a whole lot. Oh, what? Uh. Oh. Huh? How did she get there? What? No, I'm mean, gonna have to start from so far back. Because <laughs> we haven't saved since before that, that sewer section. Right, we're gonna be back on the boat. Oh! That's a pleasant surprise. Okay, so, so Sybil can teleport. That's good to know. Good to know. She can teleport. I wonder how many hits she'll take before she uh, gives up. Run, Harry, run! Oof. Don't tell me it's a one-hit kill, though. Is she just... Oh, dang. Certainly does a lot, though. We'll use one of our first aid kits. I get the feeling we're not supposed to be shooting back at her. And instead, we're supposed to find some other way to beat her. That's the impression I get. Okay. Merry-go-round has started moving. Okay. Is it going faster or what? Did it only move for that moment because of something I did? Or was that just like a random thing? All right, there's Sybil. Is she coming after me or what? Oh, what? 
She just like popped up out of nowhere <laughs> to shoot me. Um. All right. I guess that's what. And oh. now we're dead, presumably. Oh. Okay. Okay, game. <laughs> um. Hopefully, and I really mean hopefully, when we hit continue, it'll just bring us back to the fight with Sybil. It'd be a real shame if we had to do anything else. It's not like a, you get one shot and then it's over. Okay. All right, so I don't know exactly what the strategy is. I think we'll we'll use the gun and we'll shoot her quite a few more times and spend like 20, 30 bullets trying to do that and see if that works while trying to avoid what we can. But I don't know. I do have to run real quick, so I'll be back in just a moment. All right, we are we are back. And I do have a brief idea, now that I think about it. Oh, we can't use the floors. Okay. Well, can we use this? Oh, we can't use it here? I got I got excited for a moment, but no, nope, it looks like we'll, we'll stick to the gun. Stick to the strategy I was talking about. Run, run, run. Oh, not at her. <laughs> Come on, Harry. Wait. Huh? Oh, okay. Really? Oh. Oh. That gun does so much damage, right? It's like one smack into a gunshot kills us. When Harry has the light turned off, enemies will have a harder time spotting Harry. It will cut down the number of times Harry is surrounded by enemies. Let's him avoid battles or even allows Harry to speak. Sneak, I think is what was coming next. Regardless, what are we going to do here? What are we going to do, guys? I feel like we have to do something with the merry-go-round. Like, I feel like this battle is, is you know, just starting off odds against us. Like, look at that. Smack. Come on. <laughs> is this how we're going to do it? We're just going to stand in front of her and uh, fire away. Let's, let's bring out the shotgun and hopefully speed things up a bit. Oof. And at least guarantees that we're getting hits off, right? What? No! No! <laughs> I think I might have, like, intercepted the, the gunshot as it was hitting us. Come on. I thought as, as long as we were, like, this close, she wouldn't actually, like, shoot us with the gun, but... Turns out we needed to actually do a decent amount of damage, I think. How many shotgun shots do we have left? Nine. All right, I don't want to use too many more. But we at least now know that if we do enough damage, we will eventually... We will eventually move on to some other cycle of the battle. Man, this is... Whoa, she just like... She teleports. She like munching on us or what? Get, get off of me, man. Alright, we got we got quite a few in there. Aw, oh, really? What what's our health looking like? Alright, we're we're doing okay. As long as we don't get shot. So I think the uh, the strategy is shoot her a bunch of times. If she pulls out her gun, then we run. Or aw, oh, really? Um, we're still doing okay-ish. Mash, Harry! Run! Yeah, that's right. Get her off ya. At least she's not, like, shooting us anymore. That was... <laughs> that was rather problematic. Oh my goodness. Can't even imagine doing this battle without... Without a gun. It seems like it would be impossible. Run! Run, Harry, run! Nice hops back. There's gotta be... Oh, there's, like, some way to turn around fast, I think. It's like L1, R1 or something. I don't remember. But every single time we shoot her, she just comes right after us. Come on. We're not even on the camera. Aw, oh, come on, come on, come on. Run past her. Okay, good. Is she gonna teleport to us? Run, 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 run. Oh, wait, no. Did we just die? Oh. 
I didn't think I was at that low health, and I didn't think the smack would do that much. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> well. I don't know. Maybe I can strafe to avoid the, the gunshots in the beginning? That's all I can think of. Can I hit L1 and R1? I can, to turn around really quickly, which is good. No, no! <laughs> don't do it, don't do it! Aw, oh, seriously? Can I get up? What? Civil! Civil, this is not... We're just gonna start over. Like, there's gotta be, there's gotta be some strategy to that. Right, like I, there's no way the game expects me to just stand in front of her, shoot her with a shotgun, over and over, just trading hits, using healing items to the point of moving on to the next stage. Like there's no way that's the intended gameplay here. But I really don't see much else to it. I don't see much of a strategy around it. So, shotgun we will. No, 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 don't, don't shoot me. Not appreciated, Sybil. We got quite a few shots in there, though. I will say, that was like a good round. So, we have 14 bullets left, we'll, we'll reload. Come on, Harry. Stand. Gotta get up. Okay, nice. So we're moving on to the next stage. Where is she? There she is, okay. So now we'll switch to the handgun. We'll reload just to be safe. We only have 10 shotgun shots left. I'd imagine the rifle probably does a lot more damage. I know we're not, you know, probably getting the, the highest accuracy shots with that, but I'm, I'm okay with getting some distance and potentially sacrificing the, uh, aw, really? I thought we were, we had gotten away by then. Um, sacrificing maybe even the damage of the, the shots we do land in order to just get away. You know, still land some. Oh, that's way too close. All right, this should be good. She's definitely coming after us a little bit more quickly now. Oh, really? <laughs> okay, we're still doing okay on health. As long as we're not shot, we'll be okay, I think. Are you, were you even aiming at her, Harry? All right, we're gonna we're gonna change perspectives here because the whole turning around to face back at her thing wasn't working out. Oh, she disappeared and she's just gonna show up out of nowhere. Okay. All right, we'll walk a little bit more this way. Dang, she is on our tail. Nope, 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 nope. Oh man, we're gonna have to use the health drink now. Ah. Oh taking a little bit of damage. Is she like strangling us or is she trying to like poke our eyes out? <laughs> I can't really tell from where those hands are. Turn around. Is this too far? she coming? Okay, she's coming. So I'm shocked that we're even landing at all from that distance, but it is good to know that we can shoot from that distance. Um, let's keep going a little bit further. All right, now we'll turn around. Aim and fire. If we land, she'll start walking towards us, which is nice. So we've shot Sybil dead. Or undead at this point, it seems. Doesn't seem like she's met the best fate. She's like transforming into some monster. Has she been consumed by the darkness? Is she dead? she like really dead? Is she down for the count? Whether she's alive or dead? Can we move on from this battle? What in the heck? How could this have happened? Harry's torn after shooting his newfound girlfriend over 20 times. It's you again. So 
we made it through that battle somehow. Show. <laughs> the showdown. Hold it right there. I don't know who you are, or what you're trying to do, and I don't care. Just one thing. Let Cheryl. Cheryl, go. That's all I ask. Where is she? What? Did we just get shot? Force field? What's going on? Is it like a darkness force field or something? The Florus. What is it doing? Is it the light amongst the darkness? Do we just like attack her with the Flora's light beam or something like that? Do we need just like instant transmission with it or what? We get past Give the dark back, my daughter. barrier? Oof. Quite the confrontation. We meet at last, Alessa. Alessa? Oh, and the lady's back, Dahlia. Dahlia Gillespie? Where's What's she your guys' relationship? Where is she? Mama? What? Could she be? You've been a ghastly little pest, haven't you, Alessa? I was careless. Thinking you couldn't escape from our spell. Huh? But Mommy didn't know how much you'd grown. What were you up to, Dahlia? What did you do to her? That's why I couldn't catch you all by myself. Do we just get manipulated by Dahlia? But what a pity, yes? Now you're half indebted to this man for his help. Look at Dahlia's legs hey, just kind of like occasionally shifting about? back and forth. <laughs> Alessa, my dear little girl, there is one thing left I need you to do for She's gonna be like, kill him. No, get away from me. Huh? What is going on? What's going on here? <laughs> I feel you, Harry. I think for once we're on the same page. Is Dahlia really the the bad person here? Was Alessa just trying to break free from one of Dahlia's spells? Was Dahlia experimenting on her? Is all of this what happened when everything broke free or Huh? What's going on with the nurse? Why is she twitching like that? Why don't we just wake up with her? Harry. Lisa. What is going on, Lisa? What happened? Where's Alessa and Dahlia? Harry, listen. Something you said before has been bothering me. I just can't get it out of my head. What is it, Lisa? I'm so confused. So I went to look in the basement. Even though I was scared as hell. I'm shocked you went alone. Like you said, there were these creepy rooms. Yes, yes. But nothing really unusual down there. Unusual? But while I was down there, I got this weird feeling. Like I'd been there before. Were you maybe the nurse? Like something happened there. Before? But I can't quite remember somehow. Was that painting, or not painting, picture frame we Was saw, it? Alessa? Harry, help me. I'm so scared. I can't take this. It's only a temporary thing. You're in shock from when you were knocked out. Don't fret about it. You'll remember after a while. Hmm. No. You don't understand. Wait! Where do you think you're going? Uh, that's a death flag. <laughs> Upset character runs off on her own in a dangerous environment. Darn, wh what's that? That sound? From down there, it it's coming from the basement. 
Looks like we're heading to the basement. Um, yeah, that that sounds like it's not so hot for, for Lisa. Um, can we save? Nothing helpful. No, there's a save spot right there, Harry. That is something helpful. Woof. Nowhere. Huh? We're nowhere? What does that mean? Game? <laughs> so... I think, just kind of putting two and two together, I think the picture frame we saw in that room downstairs was of Alessa. Alessa is the daughter of Dahlia. Dahlia was keeping Alessa there, using the nurses, etc., to do some sort of weird witchcraft on her, experimentally. Um, Alessa got out of hand, beyond Dahlia's control. Dahlia used us to help get her under control, and Dahlia is the, the villain, is kind of the impression I'm getting. And now we have ten shotgun shots, we have... 70 handgun shots, we've got four first aid kits, three of the ampoules, and two healing drinks. I think I think we're gonna be okay. However, I don't know what's lingering in the basement. I imagine we're getting pretty close to big, big time, you know, boss fight. So, I really can't say with any certainty that we're actually safe or well prepared at this point. But, regardless, we're gonna find out what's going on in the basement, what's up with Lisa, who potentially played a role in all of this. Um, what's lying for us down there? Is Dahlia the bad person? What is she, what monster is she going to transform into that we're inevitably going to have to fight? And then, what is all of this darkness deal with Silent Hill and poltergeists and... I don't know. Hopefully, hopefully, we're going to make some sense of it in the next episode. But until that next episode, this is Moon Knight Zero, and this mission is complete. <laughs>